Following is a table of United States presidential elections in Connecticut, ordered by year. Since its admission to statehood in 1788, Connecticut has participated in every U.S. presidential election. Winners of the state are in bold. <laughs> elections from 1864 to present Election of 1860 The election of 1860 was a complex realigning election in which the breakdown of the previous two-party alignment culminated in four parties each competing for influence in different parts of the country. The result of the election, with the victory of an ardent opponent of slavery, spurred the secession of eleven states and brought about the American Civil War. Elections from 1828 to 1856 Election of 1824 The election of 1824 was a complex realigning election following the collapse of the prevailing Democratic Republican Party, resulting in four different candidates each claiming to carry the banner of the party, and competing for influence in different parts of the country. The election was the only one in history to be decided by the House of Representatives under the provisions of the Twelfth Amendment to the United States Constitution after no candidate secured a majority of the electoral vote. It was also the only presidential election in which the candidate who received a plurality of electoral votes Andrew Jackson did not become president, a source of great bitterness for Jackson and his supporters, who proclaimed the election of Adams a corrupt bargain. <laughs> Elections from 1788 to 89 to 1820 In the election of 1820, incumbent President James Monroe ran effectively unopposed, winning all nine of Connecticut's electoral votes, and all electoral votes nationwide except one vote in New Hampshire. To the extent that a popular vote was held, it was primarily directed to filling the office of vice president. In elections prior to 1820, Connecticut did not conduct a popular vote. Each elector was appointed by the state legislature. 